Hi guys, I did here. Welcome to my little tavern. Welcome to my channel. And yeah, some news on the hardcore run in Seven Days to Die. I just want to say I did not expect an alpha to drop a week after I created the series. I have only played for three in-game days uh, in a series. So yeah, I can always roll back an alpha and just play alpha twenty. But usually the experience I have from those is. At some point, I'm gonna open a chemi station or a forge or enter a PoE, and uh, it's gonna be a red text on over all over the console, and the game will crash. I will have to recuperate it. I will lose some a lot of time just invested, and I'll get mad, and I won't play, play the game. I'm very hyped hype for Alpha 21. I've been playing it because I had I did not have internet for all weekend, so I've been playing it offline. No guy, no nothing. I jumped in, made my uh, little tweaks. Uh, like I, I put all the zombies to work except for the blood moon ones. But I've really had fun just exploring the game without the, without any information on what's going on. So I'm just gonna remake the hardcore run. I'm gonna put it to scavenger though, just because I don't want to be running out of new recipe books. Like uh, you get you get the experience from reading journals. And as many journals you can read, the better XP gains. So I'm gonna put it on scavenger, and uh, the rest probably stay at the same um, same settings. So just wanna put this out. I hope I'll make it this very fast video. I don't wanna make it 10 or 20 minutes. So I'll see you guys, and uh, I'm gonna make a new game, and I'll see you guys there. 